By falling out the next day, hey, Junior woke up by hearing a knock on the door. He opened it and saw Rexy was there. Hey, Rexy, what's going on? It's Mothra. She has some news for us. Oh? Okay. Junior and Rexy met at Mothra outside of their hotel. Then they went back into the hotel and into Junior's room to have a little conversation. So, Mothra, have you figured out on how we're going to take down King Ghidorah now? Or at least put him back in the spirit world where he belongs? Well, I did. I did figure out on how we're going to defeat King Ghidorah. But you're not going to like it. Oh boy, is there a good part of the plan or no? There's a good part. Good part first, please. Okay, the good part is, is that Ghidorah won't be able to come back in any type of body right? or any creature to live inside of them and to make them his permanent slaves. Okay, and, and the other part is the fact that King Ghidorah won't be able to basically mind control anyone or any living creature to basically make them to do his dirty work for him. Okay, what's the bad news now? What's the bad part of the plan? The bad part of the plan is... We're gonna need a human sacrifice willingly to help us to put King Ghidorah back where he belongs. And it has to be someone who's willingly to go back, who's willingly to be said sacrifice to put King Ghidorah back where he belongs. So unless you find that person, does it have to be a human being or... No, it can actually be a creature. Any type of creature you can find, as long as they're really willingly to help you to take down King Ghidorah, then... yeah. Huh. Well, frick. What? Oh, I guess you don't know anyone who is willing to help us out to take down frickin' King Ghidorah? No. Yeah, we haven't found anyone. Well, that's bad. No, crap, it's... Crap, it's bad. Okay, okay, this is a problem. This is a big, big problem. <sighs> okay, so... We're gonna get to um, come up with a plan then, huh? Mm-hmm. Oh boy. I also got some bad new more bad news. Oh boy, what is it? Apparently last night, Fang, your little ex boyfriend, Rexy, he's not my boyfriend. He was just an old friend of mine that I used to have a crush on, but until he ended up killing all the scientists that we know that I've known in Dress Park. Or then I end up fighting him, and then uh, that's how I end up getting these scars. Anyways, continue. Well, S Fang has managed to get half of King Ghidorah's army back to him. Half of his army? Mm-hmm. And where are they now? They used to be on parodies, but somehow they just ended up somewhere else, and I can't find them. Wait. Oh, crap. Well, what is it? I think King Ghidorah made a teleporting device or something. A teleporting device? Yeah, it's like a little device that basically takes you wherever you go. Oh, and wherever you want to go. 
really quickly without you even having to travel on foot or by spending like a lot of money. Oh, uh, that's just great. And I assumed that Fang used his little device to get to get to King Doris's men. Mm-hmm. Okay, who did he gather, Demothra? Um, let me see. Fang got Gaigan. Um, Mecha Godzilla. Actually, three. Three of them. Three Mecha Godzillas? Oh, for the love of God! Mm hmm. Anyways, um. Who else? Mudo? Um, Orga? Destroya? Violante, Space Godzilla, Remark Prime, Mogira, Giant Servum, Death Ghidorah, and um, I think that's it. Oh, that's just mother frickin' great. Hey, is this half of his army? Yeah, half. Wait until he gets his entire army here. You were there, Mothra. You saw what happened when my parents fought the Great War. Or back in 1990s. You frickin'... Never mind. Wait, do you say Remark Prime? Yeah. The Alpha Skull Crawler? Oh, that's just bad. Well, why? Why is that bad? Remark Prime's an arch enemy of my parents. Wait, even your biological parents or. No, Rexy. My adopted parents. Kong and Lady Kong? Oh. And I think what I heard from her is, oh boy, Junior, you might have to go to Skull Island. Why, what's going on? I heard that they're planning on killing all the Kongs on Skull Island. Oh, heck no. No, I lost my parent. I'm not going to lose my adopted parents. Before Rex can stop him, him, Junior took off immediately. He hit straight to the ocean and dived dive down quickly, turning back to his Godzilla form. He decided to take a Hollow Earth entry and as a shortcut. Meanwhile, on Skull Island, Lady Khan was walking around. She was thinking about when Junior was going to come to visit. Then, suddenly, she saw... He jumped out of the water quickly. He shook himself a little bit and looked at his mom. He hugged her tightly. Mom, are you okay? Yeah, 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 Junior, I'm fine, I'm fine. Well, what's going on? No time to explain. Where's Dad? Junior, calm down. Tell me slowly what's happening. <sighs> okay. Let's just say we're all about to get under attacked. Wait, what? Yeah, seriously, come on. When they, they arrived to the kingdom, they told all everyone. And instantly, everyone started evacuating. And just like that, and Junior started leading the way. Where the cons were going to live for now on. Well, for now, just for a little bit. When they arrived, and Junior explained to Hanji everything. 
Luckily, Hodge was willing to take them in. Initially, Junior felt his ear getting pinched by someone. Then he looked and saw it was Rexy. Junior, you barely... Let me ex tell you something. I'm sorry, I was in such a rush. This got Kong and Lady Kong's attention. Then they were shocked to see who it was. Rexy? Oh, hey Kong and Lady Kong. Been a while. But you know my pa you know my adopted parents? I kinda forgot to mention that I kinda met them before. So Yeah. Wow, coming from my girlfriend. Oh crap, I said that out loud, did I? Yeah you did. This got Lady Kong's attention and she instantly hugged her son tight. Wait. So tight that he couldn't even breathe. My little boy has a has a real friend. Uh, mom, 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 you're squeezing me. Ow, 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 mom, you're squeezing me too tightly. Wait, huh. A Godzilla and a dinosaur. That's actually kind of new. What are you talking about, Dad? I'm just saying, I was kind of. It's kind of new. We're seeing a freaking. like a Godzilla and a dinosaur dating. Yeah, I know. Anyways, um, these are my. F um, Mom, can you kind of let me go? Oh, sorry. Anyways, uh, these are my friends. My new friends I made. Junior introduced to his friend all his new friends, one after another. Wow, we got an interesting group of friends here. And this Aaron Yeager guy, he's the one that King Ghidorah's targeting. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe that three-headed demon's back again. I thought we were done with him for crying out loud. Honey, relax, relax, relax. I'm pretty sure Junior has a plan on how, we're, on how they're going to get rid of him for good this time. Right, son? Well, we don't exactly have a plan yet, but we're working on that. I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys must have felt the same way when you guys were up against King Ghidorah. Uh, yeah, your father... Your father was just... Oh my god. What, what happened? He took his sweet time. Oh, uh, coming up with a goddamn plan, that's... That's what... <sighs> oh boy. I guess this might take me a while to come up with a real plan on how we're gonna get rid of him. Yep. It looks like that, Junior. It looks like that. <laughs>